Welcome to Byte Further. In today's video, you'll learn how to fix iPhone 14 white screen of death. After updating to iOS 16 or newer, many iPhone 14 users suffer white screen issues. The device is suddenly stuck and the screen is blank and white. No matter how you tap, swipe or touch the screen, nothing happens. And even when you press the power button, you can't turn off the white screen on iPhone 14. No need to worry. We'll show you the causes and some easy methods to tackle the issues. What causes white screen of death on iPhone 14? As mentioned in the beginning, most iPhone 14 users are having white screen problems after the update. So, the common reason is the update failure. If the screen starts flickering and your iPhone 14 is stuck on white screen without doing an iOS upgrade, the system glitches and misconfigured settings could be the culprits. Besides, the iPhone 14 white screen of death could also be the bad effect of jailbreaking. Though it's rare, you'll also see a white blank display showing nothing if the screen is broken or the cables on LCD go loose. Alright. Try each iPhone 14 white screen fix below to handle the problems. The solutions here also work on an iPhone 14 Plus, iPhone 14 Pro, and iPhone 14 Pro Max. 1. Toggle off the zoom function. When your iPhone 14 display shows a white screen, it doesn't always have to be a problem. If pressing the power button makes the screen sleep, chances are that you might mistakenly trigger the zoom feature and it makes your iPhone 14 spot on a totally white screen. Now, double tap the screen with three fingers together to zoom out. You can also use the assistive touch to go back to the home screen. To avoid such accidents, open settings app, tap accessibility, tap zoom, and disable the zoom option. 2. Let your iPhone 14 restart. Sometimes you find the iPhone 14 screen suddenly turns white and stays blank while you're watching videos or doing other daily tasks. In this case, the system glitch is what you're gonna handle. The fix is easy. Just do a restart. Press the volume down button and side button together. Swipe the power off slider to the right and your iPhone 14 will shut down. The white screen will disappear, too. A few seconds later, keep pressing the side button to turn iPhone 14 back on. Unlock your device and see if everything goes back to normal. 3. Force your iPhone 14 to restart. If the white screen is stuck and it won't let you shut down the phone in the normal way, try to force it to restart. Press and quickly release the volume up button. Press and quickly release the volume down button. Press and hold the side button for a while until you see the Apple logo. The white screen on your iPhone 14 should be fixed after it reboots. 4. Remove screen protector, phone case and SIM card. Just take a few minutes to do some simple checking. This iPhone 14 white screen solution might not work for everyone, but it's worth a try. First of all, remove the screen protector, as it could prevent the screen from acting properly. Second, take off the phone case, which could potentially make the screen stuck and stay blank white. Third, take out a SIM card. A corrupted SIM card may render the iPhone 14 white screen stuck. After completing all the steps above, do a force restart again and see if the issue is fixed. 5. Troubleshoot iPhone 14 via recovery mode iPhone 14 screen going white might be caused by the corrupted system. Be it a failed system update, the malware attack, hidden system bugs and so on. Thankfully, Apple's recovery mode embedded on your iPhone 14 gives you two options to tackle the problem by either updating or restoring the device. You'll need to get a Windows or Mac OS computer and download the latest version of iTunes or Finder on the machine. Once you are ready, let's begin. Open the computer and fire up iTunes or Finder. Connect your iPhone 14 to the computer using a USB cable. Then, enter recovery mode on your phone. Quickly press the volume up button then release. Quickly press the volume down button then release. Press the power button and keep holding it for a few seconds. Keep holding the power button even when you see the Apple logo screen. When you see a computer, a USB cable, and a link showing up on a black screen, release the power button. It's a recovery mode screen. Just repeat the steps to enter again if you fail. Once done, go to your computer. Now, iTunes or Finder on your computer can quickly connect to an iPhone in recovery mode. A message dialog box should have popped up, offering update and restore to buttons. Choose the update option to do an update first. It won't lead to data loss, so feel free to try it. If you still find the iPhone 14 keeps powering on and off after the update, then it may be time to use the restore button. 
It'll delete everything, including the culprit behind the white screen issue on iPhone, and then bring the device back to its factory defaults. 6. Go to Apple's Genius Bar. If the issue persists, you may be dealing with a hardware-related problem. Remind yourself if you've ever fallen down the device and make it exposed to water, or if the screen is scratched or cracked. If so or you can't target the problem, your best bet is going to the Genius Bar at Apple retail stores. If your device warranty hasn't expired, there is a chance that the iPhone 14 white screen repair will be free of charge. That's all for how to fix iPhone 14 stuck on the white screen. If you find this video helps, please give it a thumbs up and share it via Facebook, Twitter, and so on to help others in need. Also, if you have any further questions, feel free to write them down in the comments below and I'll reply ASAP. To learn more tech tips about iPhones, subscribe to the Byte Further channel. Now, you can click another video on the screen to keep watching.